William Rodriguez is my name. I work in the building for 20 years. 20 years of my life, I was a janitor. I was a person in charge of cleaning all the stairwells of the North Tower. I, I came in late, 8.30 in the morning. I'm on the basement. The building has six sub-levels of basement. B1, B2, B3, all the way down to B6. Six sub-levels. Our office was on the B1 level. As I was talking to a supervisor at A46, we're like shit chatting, and all of a sudden we hear, BOOM! An explosion so hard that pushes us upwards. Upwards. Now, 20 years in the building. Remember that. And it came from the basement between the B2 level and the B3 level. And at that moment, I thought it was the mechanical room where they have all the pumps and the generators for the building that maybe a generator just blew up on the basement. Now, 20 years in the building, you know something that comes from the bottom and something that comes from the top. <laughs> at that moment, everybody started screaming. And it was, I mean, the explosion was so hard that all the walls cracked, the false ceiling fell on top of us. The sprinkler system got activated. And when I went to verbalize that it was a generator, we hear, boom, all the way on the top, the impact of the plane on the top. Two different events, two different times. Later on, I thought that they probably didn't synchronize it well. <laughs> because we owe the truth to the world. They have used 9-11 to create a new agenda. I had an interview with a former FBI director, FBI director for the Western region of the United States, a man with 300, 300 agents under his command, a budget of $2 billion. And he's the first one who told me the whole 9-11 was a government-sponsored terrorism. It was created by us. Created by us. I, he said, I was the one that put the hundred million dollar arms package for Osama bin Laden. I am the one who had that meeting with Osama and he showed up in military compounds in and out in the last 10 years. We created Osama bin Laden. We created Al Qaeda. We created the whole illusion. We are using 9 to create a new world agenda. Why? Think about it. Who profits from this? Halliburton, General Electric, Boeing, Northrop, all these companies who are the biggest weapon makers and suppliers for the military are the ones making the dough. How working again? A company that only made meals for the soldiers. Meals. Get a 16 billion not big contract, which is illegal in the United States, illegal to run prisons in a foreign country. Then get 60 billion dollars not big contract to create concentration camps in the United States. Then they get $23 billion to create their reconstruction contract company that is going to reconstruct Iraq. Dick Cheney was the president of that uh, hunger. So I beg you to investigate and learn because there's so much information. There were no Arabs on the flying list. So I beg you to in inquire and support the families of 9 11 do the same because if not, you're going to have your own 9 11. Another event is going to happen. We don't know when, but it's going to happen. It's going to be bigger. And again, you're going to blame the Muslims. They have to finish the agenda. So please, again, God bless you all. Thank you for being here and show your support.